All right, guys, so I did a quick edge just to see. You can see the ball bearings in there on the twist. Just to see how the pattern is looking and so I can figure out exactly where I want to do my cut so I can start actually forging out from this billet. So it's looking very nice. I like the pattern. Now, this isn't going to be the final pattern after I'm done forging and everything. Things are going to move and grinding is going to clean it up a lot. But I'm trying to find that right spot where I need to cut it. So that the tip of my sword gets a really nice piece of the pattern. All right, guys, so I'm at a predicament. All right, I cannot get rid of this right here. I have to grind a lot deeper, and I'm already at a pretty good thickness throughout the sword. I don't want to really thin out my point more. So even if I bevel up my bevels, grind in my bevels, which I will do shortly, I'm not going to get rid of that. I can get rid of this pretty easily when I grind up my bevels and, you know, do my final grind, but not this. I also have this little blemish right here, which I gotta get rid of. Phone keeps unfocusing and focusing. But I gotta get rid of it, so like right around there. So I'm thinking I'm gonna end up having to cut the sword short, which sucks because I spent a lot of time forging in this tip. But it is what it is. I'm running short on time, so I'm gonna cut it, cut the tip in, and then grind in my bevels. It's going to be shorter than I wanted, but I think it's still long enough to be considered a katana. So, that's what I'm going for.
Alright guys, so I've been sitting inside making templates. So this is going to be the template for my guard or my suba. And this is going to be for the spacers, the sepa that go on both sides of this guy. So I made them in here out of cardboard and I'm just going to transfer them over to whatever materials I'm going to be making out of. This one, the canister Damascus and this guy for copper.
But before that, I would like to thank the sponsors of the challenge. Links to their websites will be in the description down below. Also, don't forget to watch the other channel builds and don't forget to vote in the link down in the description below for your favorite build. Hopefully it's me, but if it's not, no worries. My feelings will only be a little bit hurt. Again, don't forget all the links to everything, other channels, and voting links in the description down below. Let's get back to the build.